Greetings, Dr. Lobotta. Good to see your face. If I may say so, your claw is looking especially menacing today. One moment. If you're Dr. Lobotta, where's your strappy jacket? You inmates are getting ever more clever, but you still can't fool old Crispin Whitehead. I'm an orderly, you know. I am not an imposter. Good day. Greetings, Dr. Lobotta. Good to see your face. I see you're wearing your favourite jacket. If I may say so, your claw is looking especially menacing today. Up to the secret laboratory then, is it? Taking her up yourself this time, eh, Doctor? Less work for me. Inmate <laughs> Whitehead. Chief Orderly Bonaparte. You're... you're... Armed. <laughs> Well, here I am, up in the tower of an abandoned insane asylum, wearing a straitjacket, talking to myself. Okay, enough with the disguise. The things I do for Lily's brain. Well, if I'm gonna get to the top of this thing, I'd better start hiking.
Zilch, I didn't know you had a brain. <laughs> Man, I wish you were here for that joke, Bobby. Maybe I should let JT have some time alone before I return this brain.
Yo, Quentin. Good to see your brain again. I'd get your brain back.
warmer than the others.
can't get a good grip. Clem's brain. Three cheers for brains. Every cell in Nil's brain is dedicated to the ladies. A worthless shigo, <laughs> just like the one in your head. No, no, they're nice. They're, they're nice, brains, Dr. Lobato. Really? They're too nice. They won't fight. I need killers. I need angry brains. I squeeze them. I poke them. I twist them. What do I have to do to make them fight? Maybe I should try my drill. I'm not going to bring you any more brains if you're going to be so mean to them. No matter what I do? No, no matter what. 
Not even if I... Oh, not even if I cook you a little... A little turtle soup? Nice hot turtle soup. Mm -hmm. Nothing better on a cold night like this than some boiling hot soup. You leave Mr. Pokey alone! Oh, okay. You sure? No! I mean, yes! <laughs> all right, all right. Oh, why don't I just go ahead and heat you up a cup? It's made of turtles. Turtles that you love. Isn't that right, Mr. Pokey Love? <laughs> Okay, okay. Well, maybe I'll just make some for myself. Bring me a good brain, Shigo, or Mr. Pokey Loop becomes Mr. Smokey Loop. <laughs> Smokey Loop. <laughs> when you're a dentist, you have to learn to have a sense of humor, you know. It helps to calm the patients down. working for as a deranged lunatic. I know! I hate him! But if I don't do what he says, you you Cook your little turtle from the inside out. <coughs> she or hostage situations like this are always extremely delicate. I'll have to extract Mr. Pokelope from his prison using my psychic powers. After which, this Lobato character should be fairly trivial to neutralize. Yes, because once we get Mr. Pokelope back, he'll tell us what to do. He always tells me what to do. Yes. Sasha, Mia, Lily. Raz, you came. Of course I did. We gotta get you out of here. Look! The coach must have lured Sasha and Mia here on official Psychonauts business and then ambushed them with sneezing powder. They're completely brainless. I know. I saw their brains downstairs. Listen, first things first. I was thinking about what you said about us making out. Yeah? Oh man, I'm so glad he showed up. I was just starting to feel slightly less phlegmy. Wait! He didn't just hear. Ah! Get away from me! Stop reading my mind! Go rebrain Sasha and Mia so they can help us break this lock.
Come on, Mr. Pokelope. Come and get your cake. Come on, Mr. Pokelope. Come on, Mr. Pokelope. Come and get your cake. Here's what we're gonna do. Yeah, that little army man ought to be here any second. 